What's up boys and girls, Kip Campbell here from Red Air TV and today we're going to be making this shotgun a little more incognito. We're going to show you kind of how how I camo my guns, I mean all my M4s and deer rifles and everything else. I mean you can get it dipped and there's a lot of great things where you can go get some real tree and make it look real nice but I'm kind of a functionality kind of guy and more grungy as far as my approach. You know if it works, I mean why spend a ton of money on it? So we're going to paint this sucker up. To give you an idea of kind of what I like to do with my guns, I took this uh, cryptic stencil. I mean, you know, you talk about camo. We wear real tree on the show, but camo like real tree is kind of hard to replicate in the stencil, obviously. So I actually printed this online. I just got an image of Cryptek and printed that simple pattern right there online. Stuck it on my gun. You know, I've got a base layer going. This is one of my M4s. This is actually a 556 right here. But yeah, this is one of my guns. Um, you know, I gave it a paint job a while back. You can do the little Punisher skull in there, which you can do if you want to get creative. But you know, it turned out good, man. I mean, that's a uh, that's a year year ago, just about six months at least, when I painted that gun. I think. Another thing I went out and got is some painters tape, <clears throat> and you want to tape over any parts that you want to get paint down in, like the action of the gun obviously needs to be completely taped over, it's time to paint. I hope y'all like the video, there's a the finished product right there. It's uh, and I think it, I think it turned out pretty good. But um, just an easy way to camo up your gun real inexpensive so try it out man